Here at Geulhemmerberg, the Peloton passes the famous marls of Limburg. Now these rocks contain the most famous story of life and death on Earth. I'll show you. We are now inside the Geulhemmerberg. And these yellowish rocks around me were formed in the time of the dinosaurs. If we would have been here 66 million years ago, we would have been swimming in a tropical sea with squid and mosasaurs. Until one day, disaster struck. And this layer is the morning after. It's dark because everything alive just yesterday is now dead. Sixty-six million years ago, an asteroid the size of Mount Everest struck the Gulf of Mexico and caused the global extinction of the dinosaurs. All over the world, in the extinction layer, you find these little glass beads. And these little beads are droplets of molten earth rock that were smashed into space and rained back down on Earth within the next half hour. A few years ago, we found something truly spectacular in North America. Fossils of fishes with these beads stuck in their gills. This means that they were alive when the meteorites struck. And we found out by studying their bones that they died in spring in the Northern Hemisphere. This means it was autumn in the Southern Hemisphere. And that explains why so many of our survivors came from the Southern Hemisphere. Because they were below ground getting ready for winter. Now among them were also our ancestors, small nocturnal mammals, who didn't have to compete with the dinosaurs anymore, so they could step out into the daylight, put on some lycra, and cycle up these hills. Hi, I'm Marjolein Nodier, and I hope you've been enjoying these videos of the geology of the Tour de France Femme. We really enjoyed making them for you. There's more where that came from, but we can't do it without viewer support. So please consider clicking on the link, making a donation, and we really hope to see you again next year.